Today's announcements are sponsored by Farmers Emergence State Bank, your bank for life. It's Wednesday, my dudes. Good morning, Bryan City Schools. Happy May 2nd. This is a friendly reminder that book bags are not to be carried during the school day. Book bags are to be stored in your locker. Students are permitted to carry a cinch during the school day. This is the same rule currently in place since the first day of school. The second annual Humanities Expo is this Friday in the gym. Stop down between 11 a.m. and 1 p.m. to see all original artwork, music performances, and story projects from grades 6 through 12. The varsity baseball team defeated Fairview last night 11 to 1. Zach Nobus got the win pitching into the seventh inning. Nate Miller continues to tear at the plate with a single and three doubles, while Eli Tressler, Connor Lemons, and Alex Moore each added a pair of hits. The Brian JV baseball team defeated Snora 11-1 on Tuesday. Nolan Kisson fired a complete game of three-hitter on the mound. Keith Heward had three hits, including a triple. Zach Dye and Noah Bonney each added two hits, while Ethan Kondacker added an inside-the-park home run. Brian is now 16-2 overall. On senior night, it only took five innings for the softball team to secure a 10 to zero win against Hicksville. Sheridan Miller pitched all five innings, allowing just four hits. Whitney Wietro had a home run and a single along with three runs batted in, and Kelsey Terrell had three hits and an RBI. The tennis team capped off its regular season last night with a 4-1 to one win against Wasion. Colin Klingler and Eric Gendron won a thrilling three set matches. In doubles <laughs> action, Isaac Bowers and Logan King got the win at first dubs, along with Will Jackson and Brendan Reiser in second doubles. The boys will compete at the league tournament on Friday. The Bryan Junior High track team hosted a try meet with Edgerton and St. Pat's on Tuesday. The girls team placed first with 79 points. The bat winners for the Lady Bears were Caitlin Posey in the 100 hurdles and 200 hurdles, Haley Wheeler in the long jump and 200, Rachel Spies in the disc, Tina Mary Davis in the shot, and Delilah Taylor in the high jump. Their 4x4 relay of Brooke Taylor, Adea Strobietto, Lauren Lambert and Delilah Taylor. The 4x1 relay team of Delilah Taylor, Haley Wheeler, Brooke Taylor, and Caitlin Posey also won. The Bryan boys also placed first with 105 points. Event winners for the Bears were Josh Taylor in the 1600 and 800, Rylan Garza in the 100 and 200, Brady Foth in the <laughs> shot and disc, Craig Jackson in the 100 and the 110 hurdles. Kellen Rigg in the long jump and AJ Martinez in the high jump. The 4x1 relay of AJ Martinez, Jay Damron, Corbin Shepard, and Rylan Garza. And the 4x4 relay of Corbin Shepard, Kellen Rigg, Blake Group, and Josh Taylor also placed first. The junior high Bears will be competing at Patrick Henry on Thursday. Have, Have a great, great day, Brian City, City Schools. Schools. Remember, 10 more days till prom. You can get your tickets in the office with Mrs. Lupo.